Imagine a world where every sentient being is connected. A universe where each action, each thought, each breath we take is intertwined. This is not a figment of science fiction or a dreamer's fantasy. This is the essence of the Law of One. The Law of One is a philosophical and spiritual concept that posits a simple yet profound truth. That all things, all life, all creation is one. It's the understanding that we are not isolated beings, but rather we are interconnected threads in the vast tapestry of existence. Consider the ocean. Each drop of water seems insignificant on its own, but together, they form the mighty and awe-inspiring sea. In much the same way, each of us is a unique expression of the same source, the same energy, the same consciousness. This idea may seem overwhelming or even alien to some, but ponder this. Have you ever felt an inexplicable connection with someone, a sense of understanding even in the absence of words? That's the law of one at work. It's that innate sense of unity that binds us together, that makes us more than just individuals, but parts of a whole. The implications of the law of one are profound. It suggests that our actions, our thoughts, our very existence affects not only ourselves, but everyone and everything around us. It means that we carry a shared responsibility for the well-being of our world, our universe. This is not a call for self-sacrifice, but rather a call for self-awareness. It's an invitation to shift our perspective from a state of separation to a state of unity. It's an opportunity to embrace love and light and let it guide our actions and decisions. It's about choosing to live not as victims, but as conscious creators of our reality. It's about recognizing that we are not helpless, but powerful. It's about understanding that we are not alone, but all one. But how does one live according to the law of one? It begins with acceptance. Acceptance of the fact that we are all connected, that our actions matter, that we have the power to affect change. Next comes contemplation. Like Mary, mother of Emmanuel, we must ponder these truths in our hearts, feel them, and let them percolate. Finally, we must take action. We must walk our decision, live our knowledge, and serve our fellow beings in love and light. In essence, the law of one invites us to recognize our interconnectedness, to take responsibility for our actions, and to live in a state of love and unity. It's not an easy path, but it's one that leads to profound spiritual growth and understanding. In summary, the law of one is a concept that posits the unity of all creation. It's a call to shift our perspective from separation to unity and to live in a state of love and light. It's an opportunity for spiritual growth and a path towards a more conscious and compassionate existence. Remember, we are not just individuals in a vast universe, but integral parts of a grand interconnected whole. We are all one.